Bob, yeah. <laughs> can we start again? But you can cut some of it short. I'm sorry, the thing wasn't recording. No, that's okay. That's okay. okay. Yeah. So these I guys, th these police turn up. They were very polite. Um, and yes, uh, they were very polite, and they, you know, they, they, they gave, you know, they, they had the, what you said was, you know, take away my police hat. He said, you know, he wasn't. He was plain clothes. Yeah. But he said, take away my police uniform and that. He says, I'm a human being and oh, I no. feel <laughs> deeply sad about, you know, what, what, what has happened to you and your family. Oh, my God. And I, I you know, I, I felt, you know, I felt that, you know, he was, he was totally genuine. genuine. He felt it was warm yeah. and human and genuine, which is something yes. that you haven't experienced from the court yes. and the police so far. Yes, absolutely. Uh -huh. I, 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 that's why I, I you know, I, 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 I assume that perhaps there the, 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 the was some genuine officers within the force. Yeah. Um, so he said, I said, you know, I said, I really feel what I need to speak to uh, the chief consul. Yeah. yeah. And I, I, would, I would like to, he said, I'll take it back and we'll, 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 we'll come back to you. Yeah. I said, I really feel what I need to, you know, meet with them and explain and produce evidence of what I believe is fraud. Yeah. And, uh, you know, I've reported this before yeah. and you've taken no action. He right. said, well, we would ask a complaint from uh, someone. He said, I'm not sure who. He said, but he, there's a so, complaint going out. Let me slow this down. He told you that they had a complaint from someone, but they're not sure yes. who it is. That's what he said at the time, yes, <laughs> on the Friday. They had a complaint had a come from someone, we're not sure who it is, but we've yep. come here to antagonize yep. you and uh, yep. Um, yep. and be nice yes, to absolutely. you. Yes, absolutely. Yeah. Ab absolutely. Amazing. And, and, and uh, well, obviously we accepted the fact that he didn't know, but I thought, well, he probably does know who it is and he's, he's not safe. Mm -hmm. But, you know, it was a, it was a fair, it was a fair bet that it was the, um, Trustee. If, most likely, but you know, yes, yeah, so it was. It was. We yeah. were told that. We're we're calling told them that trustees, officially. but don't, don't yes, forget they're not trustees because they have never produced anything to to, to, to prove that they're trustees. No, no. Uh, but no. I know what you mean. The purported trustee, shall we say? Yes, yes. So, I mean, uh, I say, and he said, I'll take it back to my boss, and I'll come back to you. He said, I can't guarantee you anything. Right, this was on the Friday. On the, on the Tuesday morning, they arrived at the door unexpectedly. I never expected, I thought they might write to us, they might call us, or anything. Yeah. And my wife, and she invited them in, and they uh -huh. declined. They declined, they declined to come in? Yes, they declined. Ah. So they were standing at the door, mm. and they were looking rather sheepish. <laughs> and uh, yeah, 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 yeah. And the um, they declared that uh, you know it was out of their hands now, and you know they were just saying to us that would we rather come peacefully? Peacefully. And in other words, yes, they're giving you well, a choice: come peacefully, or we'll drag you yeah, by force. Yes, yes, that's what they're yes. saying. Yeah. So either way, so, of course, because come peacefully mean. You must come, or else you're coming on the yes, and and you rest. I said, "Well, look, can we come in our own time?" He went, "Oh no, 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 no." Mm -hmm. I said, "Well, you know, how long have we got?" He says, ten minutes." Wow. So I said, "What?" I said, "Well, you know," he said, "Well, we've got a, 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 a there's, there's, there is." He said, "We won't be involved in it." He says, "But other people will." We won't be I involved said, well, in it, but we are dragging you yeah. out of your house. <laughs> yes, but they, 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 they wouldn't be involved in it. He was driving a big white, a huge big white transit van mm -hmm. with this big pole on the roof, like uh, some sort of possibly, possibly a listening device. I don't know. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm not sure. But right. it was a huge big white transit van and he didn't look the part. So I can only assume that there was communication equipment or whatever it was in the back of it. Yeah. But I got a call then. At the time that they were at the door from a friend of mine who is a publican who is the, the, the governor of the pub. 
Right, right. Just down the road, and he says to me, Bob, he said, it's, you know, he sent an email saying, uh, uh, sorry, he sent a text saying, Bob, be careful, he says, I've seen some real dubious people hanging around. Right. So they were spying. Uh, they, were, they, were spying they were spying on you. Yes. They were stalking but, you, Bob. But, let's, but, let's but, say, but, but what they were stalking what they did, you. Yes. Uh -huh. But what, 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 what they actually did was, yeah. they, because they knew he was a friend of mine, Mm -hmm. in this pub and he used to know lots and lots of policemen right. you know all over the years mm -hmm. that they decided they were going to plot up in another pub at the other side of the village ah and and but he still saw several people sitting outside the property at the time yes he, he saw them and he alerted me right but um, so this was exactly exactly the time that they were standing at the door. Yeah. The front door. And um, he said, well, look, I, I said, what, 10 minutes? I said, I mean, uh, look, I, I thought this is a real friendly. You know, I, I said, well, we're all come at dinner time. Oh, oh no, 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 that's, uh, no, he said, that's not, uh, not, not possible. Uh, you know, he said, would you rather us bring you said, you know, what what we're intending to do, I've been told by my boss that, um, you know, to give you the option of, um, you know, going away with plain clothes officers. And I said, well, yeah, I don't want to get into, you know, one of them huge battles again, really. You were I understand. You, 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 want to, you want to be a law-abiding man. <laughs> yes. But I yes, just come yes. back here. I just come back here. I know. I know yeah. the answer, but I'm yeah. just because we're recording. Yeah. Them. Yeah. yeah. They entered your house. Did they have a warrant? No, no. But okay. they had a warrant. They, they had a warrant for our arrest. Did they have they a warrant, warrant for your arrest? Yes, they did. Did, did they yes. show you the warrant? No, they never showed us it. No. They didn't show you the warrant. No, no. So how no, do you know they that didn't. they had a warrant? Well, I don't know. I don't know. But I assume because the police are, um, you know, are, you know, it's not a question I asked at the time, unfortunately. You, you were brought asked. up. You were you were brought up like me. You were brought up to trust yeah. the police. Trust the police. Yes. If yes, they said yes. they had a warrant, they, they, you they believe they, they have a warrant. warrant. You know, they read me the um the. What do they call it? The um, the rights. Yes, you know, like but, but they, you the know, you don't have to say anything, and yeah. if you did that, they can read you your rights. But we're skipping yeah. one important uh, step in the ladder. Yeah, uh, yeah. They did not show you a warrant. No, they didn't. No. So no. as it stands still today, uh -huh. you have no evidence, and I mean the word evidence. Yes. That they actually had a valid warrant. No. Sealed, no, I haven't. No. And I will issue, we will say sealed by the court. No. Because, um, as it happens, if I can find it. Yeah. Um, let me just see here. Where is that letter? Ministry of Justice. <laughs> That's an anyway, I have a letter from the Ministry of Justice here. Yeah which uh, I will see if I can put up to the camera yeah and it says like any document uh, from the court must be have the name of the judge or master yeah. by whom it was made and must be yeah. sealed but could this be a police warrant I don't care it has, a, 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 the car, the, any uh, any warrant see, has to come is, from a court. A, a police, if a police want a warrant, they have to go and see yeah, a judge. Uh, they well, make I warrants. Uh, uh, they, they I mean, they're making <laughs> people are making warrants, but <laughs> it's supposed yeah. to come from a court. Otherwise, it's a make. It's it's not. You know, it's a paper. It's yeah. not a warrant. Uh, I mean, the thing is that um, I, I, you know, I, I don't know anything about. It. You know, warrants and stuff. Yeah, the legality. The so, so they they take an advantage no. that you. I, you know, are not a yeah. legal person or whatever. So, anyway, within about 10 minutes, yeah. they come into the house and they told us to switch off our mobile phones. Oh. Both, 
north of us. Right. And uh, to, you know, and mine started ringing. She said, I thought there was three lady officers right. in true plain clothes, and they were they had police written all over them. You know, like uh -huh. um, body body armor or whatever it was. Oh, I see. Because and every they time they've come to your house, for some reason, they've come uh, armed. They told me, mm -hmm. no, they weren't armed, but they told me that it was all going to be a low key. Low and key, we would, okay. Uh -huh. And we, we assumed that we'd be taken away and it would be charged or whatever. They would go to court, then we'd come home. Yeah. That's what we thought. Yeah. And, and that's what they led us to believe. Right. But that did not take place. Right. What, 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 what happened was we were read, uh, she was upstairs, we brought her down, and uh, my wife down, and they, uh, they, 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 they said, you know, um, turn your phones off now, mm -hmm. turn your, your phones off now. I, I, I mean, I invited them in because I was expecting them, because, but not quite as quickly. Yeah, but they, they, we know, we, they, we they know that they were all around the corner. You thought they were coming to help you out in some ways? Yes, yes. yes. So you were, so not, they were, you were not letting them on the basis that they no. were coming to arrest you? There was, there was two plain clothes officers yeah. and three uniformed women, not, uni not full uniform, no. They were plain clothes, but they had police written on the yeah, yeah. jackets. So they are probably like CID or something, I don't know, yeah. Or no. the armor or whatever it was. Yeah. So, they came into the house and they told us to get whatever we wanted together. Um, if we had any medication or um, important documents such as passports, etc., 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 and we should really pack them. And we're beginning to get a bit um, worried at this time because we thought, well, you know what, what? What's going on here? Because you told us that we thought we'd be coming back, and we we, well, we yeah, yeah, you're going to the police station. Yes. So why we do you need your important things? Well, exactly, exactly. <laughs> and, 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 you're, and you're going to the police station what, to be what, charged. What he said. Uh -huh. What he said was, and this straight away, you know, this was the first lot that came. Yeah. He said, we will we'll have to notify the complainant that you have been arrested. And I said, then, it was too late, I said, well, we're, we're, I'm not happy with this at all. I said, why have you got to tell the complainant straight away? You could tell them this afternoon. You could tell them, oh, no, 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 we've got to do that, right? They have to so tell the complainant, but they, you still don't know who this complainant is. Not at that time, no. Mm. But I did know, really, I did know. It was no, 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 you didn't know. No, I didn't know. No, you, you, have you, know, a, you have an idea and you have a feeling I had an idea, yes, based yes. on the the past information, yes, but in yes. the moment, and, yep. and maybe even now, you have yep. no proper evidence who the complainant no, is. No, I haven't, no, okay. no only, only hearsay. Yeah, exactly. Um, but when he said to me that they were going to notify him straight away, the complainant, I knew the game was up. And it was too late for me to do anything about it. What do you mean the game was up? Well, the game was up. What I mean by the game was up was because the only reason that they would notify them on our arrest was to invade our home. Right, but you were not charged yet. You were only arrested. Yes, I was, uh, you know, what would they call it? No, I wasn't charged. I was... Uh, you were arrested. Caution was it or... No, you know, no, when, no. They, when they come and ask you yeah. to come with them and switch off your phone, when they ask you to switch yes. off your phone, they have, taken, right. they have right. taken away your liberty in that yes. moment. Yes. Mm -hmm. So you were arrested. However, yeah. you had not been uh, given any details. No, but that. I was read the, um, you yeah, know, yeah, like yeah, you yeah. don't have to say anything. Uh, I know, Bob. I know, Bob. So. I know, Bob. But mm -hmm. I'm yeah. just clarifying. Yeah, you were you had no idea. No, no. To whom you have caused any harm or loss? No, no, I didn't. No. Uh huh. No. And no. You, you were not given any evidence as to what no. was the harm or loss you caused to another no, man. No, and I wasn't. I, I wasn't. A woman. There was no warrant produced at any point. And there point. was no warrant 
um, available no, to show you. There was no paperwork at all. Let's put it this way: they had no sealed warrant. No, wait, no warrant of any kind. <laughs> a sealed or unsealed. Unsealed. Okay. So yep. okay, but, carry on. Yeah, we just want to establish yeah. the, the, the so, fact. So then the alarm bell started ringing. I mm. thought myself, this is this is looking really uh, bad now. This is looking down the barrel, so to speak. Yes, yeah. uh, this is really. I, I, I said to her, I said, I think we've been duped here. I think we really have been, you know, and we You've were separated. In, in, in yeah. our home, they took her aside, they mm. took me aside. Yeah. They, Drove us, they drove us, we, we, we were taken outside, mm -hmm. I was taken outside, they kept her in, and the, uh, the, 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 he had the keys to the house, and I said, well, what, what are you doing, one of the officers had the keys to the front door, and wow. he said, you know, I said, well, what, you know, he wouldn't answer the question, I said, what are you doing with them? What's your house you know, key got to do with a policeman? Police oh, that's right. That's yeah. correct. That's absolutely correct. And he said... Um, no, no, he wasn't aiding. He stole the keys. Yes, he stole the keys. Yes, yeah. yes, he did. He did. He did. Not aiding in a bit. I mean... It's theft. Yeah, I mean, we were going to leave them. We yeah. said, uh, we were foolishly as we were, as foolish as we were, we said, we'll leave them under a pot at uh, the front door for my daughter and my son to come and check the house is okay. In our, in our absence, you know, um, which, you know, which we felt was the right thing to do. Mm. But he took the keys from Marie and he said, uh, no, I said, I've got to take these. I said, well, why is that? He's got to take them. Is that he, what he, he said? said? I've yes, got to take them. He said, I, 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 I'm, I said, I'm taking these keys. I'm taking uh, these keys. Yes. What's that yes. got to do with the offence you, you you committed? Both? Well, that's absolutely correct. Ah. That is absolutely correct. Because by taking your keys, he's taking yep. your house and he's taking all the belongings of your house yes. and your family. Yes, indeed, indeed, uh -huh. he is, yes. Um, but we realised by that time that this was more serious than met the eye. Yeah. We thought we were going for a sort of informal meeting and we were going to be like, oh yeah, okay, you go back home and we'll decide whether we're going to take it to, we'll go to the CPS to sign or, or, or something like that, you know. Yeah. And for the mere fact that they were so friendly and so forthcoming that we thought we could trust them. Yeah, and so they, the, dete they, um, the detectives when someone they come in. When someone um, takes advantage of your trust, yes. that's what they call a con artist. It's a confidence yes. trick. They take yes. advantage of your confidence and trust in them. Yes. Yes. And their yes. uniform. Yes. Because they're yes. in that yes. uniform of authority and, 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 and lawfulness. Well, we... Trusted them. Yeah, what happened after that was we were taken away in separate vehicles. My God. And, yeah, we were separated. We never saw each other uh, from half past nine or so Gosh. until got, uh, quarter past six in the evening when we were allowed out of the cells. We were in separate cells. <laughs> we, I, I never saw her from the time we left our home. My God. Uh, we had DNA taken. Uh -huh. We had fingerprints taken. And we had uh, our photographs taken. Yeah, you had your mug shot, yeah. Yep. Um, I hadn't had it done before, so, I, you know, this is this is something that was new to me. It's traumatic, yeah. Yes, absolutely. Um, I, I felt then that this, this was a, a, a more a criminal, um, you know, I, I, I felt then that I was actually a sort of... You were a convict. Yes. <laughs> you know, I thought this is this is definitely more than a than than, than just a, a a a matter for the civil course because because of the fact that we had been charged. You will not charged, but um, we had been read 
caution. You're being processed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> You're being processed like a criminal. <laughs> I mean, bearing in mind you guys have been under um, oppression and I would even say under terrorism for uh, quite some time, it's yeah. not just the one day, it's the, it's, the, it's the adding up of, you know... Well, we've had all sorts of people standing outside, yeah. uh, not, not standing, but sitting in cars, they've been photographing, they've been looking. They've been, they've been how uh, the vultures. It, they had vultures, been, a lot yes. of vultures hanging around, awaiting. Uh, absolutely. The thing yeah. is, Anthony, the PD is half a million pounds for them, half a million pounds. Yeah. And my next payment on the mortgage is during the twenty eighth of this month. Uh -huh. And and you know, it's been paid for twenty five years nearly. Yeah. It will be it will be finished in about nine months time. Uh -huh. You know. So I've been breaking into your house I've been paying a mortgage on. You didn't break into your house, don't worry about no. it. No. Yeah. Yeah, you, you know. Yeah. And well anyway, so they got us to the we we had several bags of documentation, documentary evidence in relation to um our, uh, you know, our, 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 our situation. Yes, but of course, uh, and, um, a lot um, of this evidence has been filed at the police. Yes. Yes. Well, so they, they had on, on their they, file, they had the facts, yeah. they had the true hard facts that yes. you're not a burglar, yes. you're not a trespasser, you're not a criminal, no. you're not Bangkok, no. there's no court proceedings no. against no. you, Omar. No, no, no. no. Issued no. by the court. No, 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 that's absolutely right. Yeah. Now, <coughs> we were assured that we would have a hearing, uh, you know, we, 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 not a hearing, we, we were assured that we would be allowed to produce these documents at the station yeah. in relation to us being charged. Yeah. And we would, we, we, we would be able to, um, uh, we would be able to, uh, Justify our our, um, our stance in breaking into our home, and so we took uh, a couple of bags of documents. Yeah. Uh, in relation to you know uh, to to us justifying the, the, our claim that the house was ours, and they they took the documents. So it was a quite a heavy bag of documentation. Yeah. yeah. And the. Uh, they um, took them from us when we went into the custody suite. Right. So you, two, you, had, you had paperwork on you? Yes, we had, two, I, I had a heavy, heavy bag of paperwork. Okay. Yes. And I know some of the paperwork. So you yep. have paperwork on you which can show... Yeah, we, we were taken in separate cars. I arrived first, I think. Mm. No, she arrived first. <clears throat> So we were in this other bit, so we had to wait until she was charged uh, before I was allowed into this particular part where right. there's a desk with a sergeant mm -hmm. on it and, that, and there's all these lines of cells, um, you know, up and down the, uh, you know, there's all these different cells. Yeah. Um, so they took about 20 minutes or so, 25 minutes to process her into mm -hmm. the building. Yeah. And I thought we were going to be, um, I thought we were going to be uh, interviewed straight away. Yeah. You know, which yeah. obviously was planned and, and they should have had officers there to interview us straight away and I, I assumed this is what was going to happen. Yeah. But unfortunately, when they took her through, yeah. uh, they kept us in this other you know, before we went through. Mm. Then when I went through and they charged me, they told me to take my belt off and my shoes. <laughs> and I said, well, what, 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 what is going on here? Mm. And they said, 
Well, we're, we're going to bring you up. We're going to put you in a, a cell pending, you know, like your uh, your interview. Right. And I went, oh, right. Uh, you know, oh, you know oh, what is that? I mean, I thought I was going to be interviewed. Yeah. No. I, I was put in a cell mm -hmm. and they said, do you want a cup of coffee? Or tea or whatever. I said, yeah, I'll, 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 please, I'll, I'll have a cup of tea or whatever. Yeah. Uh, I think I had a cup of coffee. And they brought me in a paper cup. Uh, and uh, I waited until in the, you know, where, where they charge you. Yeah. I waited there and they took, uh, they, 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 they brought back a cup of coffee and they said, right, you know, follow me and uh, take your shoes and your belt off. I, oh no, sorry, they took the belt off and they put it in a plastic bag and they took everything out of my pockets, all my belongings, and they put them in a plastic bag. Uh, you know, which was keys, I took all the keys out of the house for, the, for my vehicles. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, like, um, my daughter's car was there, I took the keys for that as well. Yeah. And um, I, you know, they, so they took all these anyway at the uh, reception desk. And uh, he said, you know what your chance were? I went, yeah, well, I said, no, I, I, I mean, I'm, I'm uh, you know, I'm, I'm, as far as I know, I'm going to be interviewed. Right. You know, I, 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 no, I was put in a cell as for, you know, like, uh, uh, they gave me a cup of coffee and they shut the cell door and I never heard another thing until I heard them bringing my son in to an adjacent cell mm -hmm. uh, about a couple of hours later. Wow. And uh, they brought him into a cell. Now, where, where she was, I didn't know at that time. Yeah. Well, uh, I assumed that she was, I you know, I did ask them several, several times where she was, and uh, they went, well, well, you know, same as you, you you know, I said, well, when's this interview? And this was about 10 o'clock or so, and we weren't interviewed until gone 4 o'clock that day, right. and we were held in a cell, mm -hmm. we were held in separate cells, we didn't have any, and when I asked where, how she was, and when I asked how my son was, they said, we can't discuss other, um, prisoners with you. Other prisoners? Well, other, uh, other whatever. I know. A, 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 anybody else. Yeah. You know. But by this time, you, you, you felt like a prisoner. Yeah, well, 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 I, I, well, I, I had, um, well, uh, 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 um, a toilet there in the, um, mm. in the cell, which was, you know, uh, just what I was, it's just a, 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 a cell. You know, it's, yeah. there was one yeah. window high up in the room. You were high in, up in you the, basically, you were in confinement. Yes, I was in you confinement, were, yes. Or yeah. you would see on the television or Activity. in the courtroom yeah. or something yeah. like that, yes. Yeah. Yes. And, I, I, you know, and, and around about four o'clock or so, um, I was offered dinner at um, dinner time and they brought that in. It was absolutely disgusting. Mm. Uh, it was a microwave um, packet of uh, food. Yeah. And, um, you know, I, 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 and a paper spoon, <laughs> a cardboard spoon. And, you missed, uh, you missed your kitchen, I'll, Bob, and your, <laughs> your food. And I, I asked the officer for a glass of water, and he went, yeah, okay. And they went off, and he never came back. Mm. And I, uh, I said, another um, officer come and says, I'm, after, I'm looking after your well-being. I want you to make sure you're, <laughs> you're uh, is, there you need, is there anything you need? And I said, well, I wouldn't mind a, a newspaper. Yeah. He went, oh, yeah, okay, I'll, I'll come back with one. Never come back. Wow. So, uh, round about gone four o'clock, we, uh, he, uh, the cell door opened, and um, our officer said, oh, do, you, do you want to come with us? Um, your duty solicitor has arrived, and, um, you know, he wants to see you. Um, so I went into a room, a small, this other small detention room, yeah. and I was uh, met with the, this this chap who said, to, you know, like he, you know, he said, look, you know, the best thing for you to do is just to, you know, you can't get out of this one. It's a criminal offence. Is that what he said? To uh, you? Yes, it's a so, criminal so, offence. So yeah. did they at squat, when squat, they squat is a criminal offence? What what they when they said to you you got a solicitor due to sol did they yeah. tell you he was an independent solicitor? Yes, they did. 
he said he was totally independent. He totally said independent. To the police. Okay. okay. And then he said to you, you can't get out of it. It's a criminal offence. Yeah, well, that's right. He said to me that, um, more or less, that I should um, put guilt, well, mm -hmm. put, admit to the fact that I had done what they said I'd done. Yeah. I was guilty of squatting, trespass, and criminal damage. Mm -hmm. Um, which he said, look, you know, uh, you know, they are going to. I said, I. He said, I would assume they're going to let you. They said to him, obviously, that they were going to let me off with a caution if I would say, I, uh, you know, if I agreed that that, that what I had done. Okay, so this solicitor, yeah. I don't yeah. know if you know his name, but... Um, yes, Khan, Mr. Khan. Mr. Khan. Yeah. Uh -huh. um, not Mr. Um, Khan, by any chance. I think I've got his card somewhere. Oh, um, okay. Well, I just want to backtrack yeah. a little bit to Mr. Khan. Yeah. yeah. He told yeah. you yeah. that you can't get out of this one. No. And then well, he said... No, uh, no, he never said you can't get out of it. What he said is, you know, I told him the fact. Yeah. of the, yeah. you know, the, 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 the case and that. And he says, I, I find this incredibly hard to believe. He said, you know, are, are, you, are these facts correct? I said, listen, I am telling you now, this debt was for £35,000. And he said, what, and it's escalated. He said, how, how much do you own your house? I said, well, my mortgage is nearly finished. I've got half a million pounds worth of equity, at least. And he went, nah, he said, something's wrong here, something's definitely wrong. Right. And I said, he come from Luton, I think. I think he come from Luton, this guy. Yeah. Um, uh, but, but solicitors, that's who he said he was from. I've got his card somewhere. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, so he said to me, Right. He said, something isn't right here, something is definitely wrong. Why didn't they put a charge on your property in the first place? I mm -hmm. said, well, you tell me. You know, I, I was very green, which I still am uh, now. And I don't know why. He said, well, why can't that? It's got to be the most common thing. I said, yes, but they didn't want to put a £35,000 charge on my property because, quite simply, half a million pounds a better pay day. No, but that's not the issue, Bob. We're, we're, we're no. missing the point here. No. So what how, you said was... What, how... These people, whoever they are, calling themselves yep. trustees and all that... Yes. Yeah. Where is the evidence that they are a trustee? Where is the evidence that there is an order from the court? Where is the evidence that they, they, they have... Uh, in authority but the to, thing to is interfere well, in your in your property and your life yes i mean the That's thing the is no, they, all they do is the the totally disregard questions like that they disregard them they feel that they don't have to even answer them no but you see that they whoever is the complainant yeah, yeah. they were in your house yeah drawing on the Human Rights Act, peaceable enjoyment yep. of your home. Yes, that's correct. Someone wants to get you out of your house and interfere yep. with your rights or whatever. Yeah, yeah. They are an aggressor. Yes. They are the one who have to prove uh -huh. yep. their standing. It's yep. not up to you to prove no. that they're wrong. It's no. up to them no. to prove no. they have no. a, a cause in that's law right. and yep. that they, they, they are not uh, criminal thugs. Yes. Yes. So this is uh, um, the, the problem I'm having with Mr. Khan. Yeah. He's giving you advice and he hasn't established yeah. any of the facts. No, 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 no. Right. No, that's right. Okay. So no, from what I can hear you say here, uh -huh. no facts have been established. No fact. No fact no. and no evidence no. have been put on the table. That's no, it. No. That's all I'm trying to establish. Yes, yes. Yeah. Mm. There, there was no warrant shown. Nothing. Nothing but has been happened. put on the table. But the way they did it was quite simply extremely well acted out. 
I know the way they did it, Bob. It's called deception. Yes. Fraud yes. act. Yes. Deception. Yeah. 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 Uh, I mean, like I say, uh, at the time, what he said to us was, um, well, I don't know what he said to her, but I think he said the same. I asked her, uh, you know, because I had no contact with her. I wasn't even interviewed with her. We were interviewed yeah. separately. Yeah. And we were, we get, she, when she took the bag of evidence, the woman called us from the woman. Yeah. So, she yeah. said, so this uh, is very important, yeah? Yeah. You're speaking to a solicitor there. Yeah. You had your hard evidence in black and white with you. Yeah. And it was never brought into play. No. Right. No. Okay. Uh, they took they took the bag they took the bag of stuff away. And they said, Oh, we've got a photocopy at all. No, they don't have uh, any authority. Under what authority can they photocopy? Yeah, but they they asked they asked if they could talk. I said, Yes, you can photocopy it. Okay. And I, I thought to myself, I said, are you sure you're going to do that? I said, there's a hell of a lot of documents there. And they oh, yeah, yeah, that'll be fine. They didn't full copy one copy, not one. Okay, but they, they still, we're coming back to the documents. Number one, the yep. solicitor is giving you advice. Yep. And but, he, but what they didn't want to know, what he said to me was as far as that, don't go into too much detail. <laughs> Bob, he said, Bob, Bob, Bob. Yeah. Let's forget about them for the minute, yeah? Uh, yeah, that was it. That was the solicitor that told me that. Okay, fine. And I, I want to come back to the solicitor. He's telling you, don't go into too much detail. Yeah. He wants you to accept, he wants you to accept oh. a false charge. Yeah. Yeah? yeah. They, what he wanted me to do, what, what they were more or less saying to me was, if you accept a portion, you will be able to walk out of here free. If not, you could be kept here a, bit, a lot longer. Right, so so they are giving you a threat. Yes. They are giving you a threat. Yes, yeah? absolutely. If you don't absolutely. feel guilty, we're going to punish you. No, well, they have already punished us as far as I was concerned to keep me in a cell until gone 6 o'clock at night. No, I know, Bob, but they're telling you yeah. further. If you don't plead guilty, we're going to do you some more harm. No, 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 yeah, they, can, they will keep me in there a lot longer because right. what they'd have to do is if they could get hold of the duty solicitor. I wasn't only thinking of myself, remember, I, mean, I was thinking what sort of state is no, she no, going no, to no. You, whatever yeah. it was, that's fine. It's what it, it was what it yeah. was, but I'm just saying, yeah. is, is there a television going on in the background? Yeah, I'll, I'll move in a minute. I'm, I'm just going to... Okay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so uh, what it is, they are... Coming back to the solicitor, uh, he is advising you and he hasn't seen any evidence. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you had your evidence there with yes. you. Yes, I did. So but this, I, I this duty solicitor... Right. They weren't going to take any. No, no. Fine, fine Bob. I yeah. just wanna, Bob. I just wanna come back to the matter of evidence because if you're yeah. dealing with the law, yeah, the law only deals with evidence. Yes. Anything else? We're talking about kidnapping and all that sort of thing. So, oh, well, that's absolutely right. Yeah. So, yeah. Well, let's talk about evidence for a minute. You were arrested for committing a crime. Yes, I was. And you have the evidence on you that shows that you did not commit a crime. Yes, but they weren't prepared to look at that. Right. So now they we can move on. To look at that. Now we can we move had, on. We had, we had the, the, the land registry each. No, you had everything, uh, Bob. You had everything. Yes, we had everything. I know there. what you had. They, they, they didn't want to look at it. Right. And I right. said to the solicitor, can I bring through my evidence? And they say, he said, no, not really. <laughs> he said they, no. <laughs> It's a, it's a great solicitor, Mr. Khan from Luton. Uh, <laughs> well, <laughs> you know, the independent, he's the independent uh, solicitor. Uh, after, <laughs> after been in the cell all that time, mm. I just wanted out. I no, had they, had you, they had you under duress. You're hungry and tired. Yeah. And you're vulnerable. Yeah. Yeah, yeah you're yeah. vulnerable. Yeah, um, so, I mean, 
what they were saying was, oh, well, we don't know if we can get a hold of them if they can um, at this time of the day, and more or less they were implying that I'll, I could be there until the morning. So they're giving you an implied, they're giving you an implied threat? Yes. Yeah. Yes. They, were, they didn't say to you, oh, Mr. Bob, we don't have any evidence on which we can hold you, so please go home. They no, didn't say, no, no, okay. no, 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 no. Fine. Yeah, so, uh, no, what, what it was, I, you know, if it was, uh, had it been only me, I could have probably stayed there all night. Yeah. But, uh, but they wouldn't tell me one thing about what she was feeling like, or, and I, I, I thought myself, she's, she's in a similar position, obviously, herself, the same as myself. Yeah, I understand. You're worried about your wife and you're worried about your, yes. your son, and yeah. I, 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 I thought myself, this is this is terrible. This is this is this is the worst scenario this imaginable. Is, this is terrible. This is terrible. Yep, yep, yep. Terrorism. This is the worst scenario. And I, if I could have turned the clock back at that time, I would have done because I felt let down. And and they asked me, was I suicidal? I said, well, I'm not suicidal. No, I said, but but I. He said, well, how do you feel? This is all part of the. Um, no, what what they drive? Yeah, what they're driving at. They wanted to talk, say your distress and that, and then they get a psychiatrist to turn yes, you off as yes, mentally ill. Yes, that's right. That's it's right. It's a trick they're doing every day. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, they, they, she had a psychiatrist come in to see her. Oh my God. Uh, yes. And yes, also, Bob, that was an independent psychiatrist as well. Yeah, no, I don't know, I don't the know. The solicitor was really independent, and the psychiatrist is independent. Yeah, no, well, she was, you know, she wasn't taking it too well, I believe, you know. And my son was in there also, yeah. who they didn't release for about a couple of hours until after us. Yeah. Um, and unfortunately, the way, uh, you know, I mean, I mean today, I, I, I said to her, should we have not admitted guilt? And she says, I'm going to phone him up today and I'm going to tell him that I am not guilty and I want now, I don't want the caution, I want to be charged. So she would still be prepared to do that. But that's, that's what you should have done in the beginning. Yes, I know, but the thing is, we, we thought, I thought, when I went in first, you see, I never did any contact with her. Yeah. So I couldn't establish what exactly she was feeling like because she'd never been in. A no, I understand. You were, you were, you were, you were terrorized. Yeah. Terrorized. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's not. It's the most dingy, horrible, dusty place that I've ever been in. There's a plastic uh, mattress. I mm. thought myself, my God, yo, this, 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 this is inhuman. And they didn't, you know, they put the flap up on the door, like you see on the television. Yeah. And you're just, you're just chucked in there and forgotten about it. Yeah. You know, they just don't, they, you know, this, all they were interested in doing was to get us in themselves. And I realise that now. Yeah. They wanted us all, all for the streets, away. And we were told that after we left, that there was probably around more police than were than had never been there before. Right about forty. That's what we were we were told. There was round about forty police, three transit vans and probably three or four cars. Yeah. And they're shutting police stations everywhere all around the country. Well we we, we had um Mr Cameron yeah. saying Afghanistan and Nigeria are fantastically corrupt. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Only a couple of <laughs> few days ago. Yeah. Um, it's, what about good old Britain here? Where well, we're coming across on the internet and in real life, uh, yeah. um, thousands and thousands of people. This, this, uh, this, this, this is the most corrupt country in there. <laughs> this is got to be the most corrupt country in there. I don't care what anybody says. Uh, I, uh, I, 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 you know, I, I, I think of the instances of the corruption that has, um, that I have experienced, you know, uh, um, and that is, they, they talk about, the, you know, the, 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 this 
this is the sort of British stuff that they send all around the world, isn't it? Well, they yeah they spread these rumours that you know this image yeah, and, and, and they, 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 they manage, and everybody should follow and yeah follow the British system yeah 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 ah. yeah yeah but what I experienced yesterday Anthony was was was, was a situation where I thought and I still believe now that we were had over we were we were taken off the streets. And we were released as and when the place was secured. Yeah. And now, now there is a gap with them dogs, uh, dogs on the premises. Mm. Police, to, uh, some sort of, um, you know, um, yeah, guard dogs. A security company with um, yeah. guard dogs. Yeah. Yeah, and um, and uh, we. Um, you know, we, 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 we felt absolutely disgusted. And my daughter called Kempston Police in Bedford, near Bedford, the police headquarters, Bedfordshire Police. And she laid into him today. She phoned him up, this guy who had been Mr. Nice Guy. And she said, I'm really disgusted in you. And she really didn't miss and hit the wall. She really said, you know, I don't know how you can look at yourself in the mirror after what you did to my parents. She said, I'm so disgusted because we thought that you and your colleague were really decent people and you led us up the garden path. Yeah. And that's a fact because we are honest people. We we take people at face value and we were, we, 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 we were duped. We were, it was disgraceful. And they, they, what they said to us was, "Do you would you rather go, you know, like up for questioning, um, um, you know, would, would you like to go out with plain clothes officers rather than all them police and all that trouble I had before?" I said, "Yeah, I'll, I'll come up there, you know, thinking that I was going to be up, interviewed, and come home. That was it." But what they did, what they, what, what, what they did yeah. was disgusting. Because what they did is after we, after we had gone, there was around forty officers. Yeah. Forty police officers involved uh, at, at my premises again. Again. So and all that, all that nonsense about did you, you know, you want to keep it low key from the neighbours and all that, which is nonsense. Well, all, all it is, all it is, you've had a burglary. And the yep. burglars are the police in this case. Yeah. That's all it is. Yeah. And, yeah. and you are yeah. conned. Yeah. And they took yeah. your keys. Yeah. But the thing I want to uh, um, bring about here is they've, they've brought an, a large number of police, yeah? Well, we never saw them because no, we were. I know, we I know. But we, we've, heard, we've heard and we know they had a large number yeah. there. Yes, absolutely. Yeah? And mm -hmm. What appears to be the case is the police are not there to do police work. Because if they were there to do police work, you've got, you yep. got 20 police or 40 police, uh -huh. yep. and you don't have a single warrant. Yep. So if they were yep. there to do police work, at least one out of the 20 or out of the 40 police yeah. would um, make sure the, the warrant was there and it's valid and, and it, you know, it was well, issued from a yes. court. I, I mean, I didn't realize at the time have they got to, uh, if they arrest somebody in the street, they don't have to have a warrant for it. No, but if they come to your house to arrest you, and to come into your house... Oh, right, okay, they've got to have a warrant. Yeah, or also, if, if they... Well, if, I actually invited them in, because I thought... That fine, fine, was, but they, they came in on the false pretenses. Yes, yes, so I thought, because, yeah. you know, I thought this is a civil matter, as they have always been taken. Throughout. They have told no, you many we're times. Involved, we're not getting yeah. involved. And if somebody arrests arrest you, the, the man who makes the allegation, mm. or they have to tell you what the allegation is and provide the evidence. Yeah, you yeah, haven't been yeah. given any evidence of no, your of no. your each of your. What, um, what, 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 they, what they are saying is is because of my bankruptcy. What? That, that, what? That, wait, that, Bob, 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 Bob. Let's stop yeah. there. Yeah. What evidence have they got of your bankruptcy? I have no idea. You have no to idea. Be honest, no, I've got no idea. Are you lawfully bankrupt? 
I've got no idea. No idea. Well, I'm telling you, no. I'm telling you as an accountant that's been working yep. on your case. Yep. You are not lawfully bankrupt and the police have a legal department that they can verify um, documentation and court matters and yeah. they haven't done it. So they have yeah. committed an offence because yeah. they told you you're bankrupt and they have no evidence whatsoever. Yeah. And they I have not given you a chance to contest the, uh, the evidence and they had the evidence which they took away yeah. from you. And yeah. this solicitor, yeah. Mr. Khan, has given you advice yeah. based on uh, no evidence. Uh, when uh, he had uh, access uh, to the evidence, yeah, yeah, he, yeah. he did not go on evidence. So that means he is operating on a motive yeah. which is not to do with establishing the facts and the law. No, 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 right. no, no, no. That's right, that's right. That's, that's, yeah, yeah. No, I, 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 of course, I agree with that, yeah. yeah. But look, I'm, I'm going to wind this up now, but uh, okay. we'll be in touch right. and my, my heart goes out to you. We've been doing a lot of work in the background and we've come up yeah. with some new um, data and in information which shows okay. Okay. shows a little bit more information. When, when, when must we check in then, aren't they? Um, well, I have called you a few times and when I heard oh, you yeah, arrested, I, know, I, 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 sent you, I sent you a text exactly what to say to them. Yeah, but of course, yeah, they yeah, took yeah. your phone. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. Which, if you said it to them, it would have made their uh, life a lot harder because yeah, we're just yeah. saying uh, you, you've never been evicted from your house. No, you've never no, sold no, anyone no. your house. No, and no, you've never no. authorized anyone to sell your house. No, no, Those no, three no, things, no. nobody can argue with. But anyway, I think it's a good thing what happened, Bob. It's very stressful and distressing, but it's a good thing. It will help your case. And it was well, we're home, we're home, home was again quite simply. We're home was I again. know, it's unbelievable. It's unbelievable. It's terrorism. And, you know, yep, yep. David Cameron was talking about Nigeria and Afghanistan. He has yep. no idea. No, 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 no. Where is the no, Nigerian, no, he, he, where no, is the Nigerian no, oil idea. money stolen going? Where, where is the Afghanistan weapons? Where did they get it all from? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Exactly. It's just nonsense. Anyway. Absolute nonsense. I will be Absolutely. in touch. And, uh...